All right, ladies and gentlemen, prepare yourselves for the weirdest LP in history. For some god awful reason, we're doing a playthrough of Jeopardy. Because we couldn't come up with anything else. Uh, and what we were originally going to do uh, didn't work. So uh, I'm Andy. I'm Katie. And uh, this is Jeopardy, so we're going to test our knowledge against the computer. Which we, uh, Andy and I actually compete in trivia, and we bought this game because we recently competed in the state championships of our t local team trivia. And we did thing. good. Yeah, we placed so, second in the state, yeah. so uh, by sure. two points. We, we very easily could have gotten first. I'm thinking uh, we, we should maybe do this on hard mode, just because it's an LP. Uh, well, we won't be able to answer anything. You remember what hard mode is like on this. Okay, fair enough. Well, we'll do normal mode. Medi medium is... is, is we'll we'll is do normal. mediocre mode or medium mode. Okay, classic stage. Eh, yeah. We that's thought we thing. could hack the uh, hard mode, but it's some obscure shit. Yeah. Well, we can. It's just... It's actually more... It's not so much the questions in hard mode as it is what the other players know and how fast they buzz in. It's I disagree. I thought the hard mode was way over my head. Uh, the first time was kind of hard. The second the time wasn't time bad. Was, yeah. The first time was brutal. So it wasn't too bad. Maybe that's what turned me off. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, let's see who our competition is. Uh, we've played several, several games of this. Enough to know that there's lots of loading screens here, which we'll probably replace uh, here the next loading screen with, uh, I don't know, maybe uh, John Tyler, Chester E. Arthur. We're going to pick random what presidents. What was the guy, William Harrison? Or well, uh, yeah, William Harrison or whatever the yeah, guy who... The guy who died of pneumonia yeah, a so month into his presidency. We may throw him down he's and see. He's our hero. Yes, because he's stubborn and stupid and still was president. So, welcome to our, like, 36 people crowd. Oh, hey! We're it's basically a Markiplier. <laughs> oh, in a sweater. <laughs> and here's contestant number one, Sweet they Tits. Play and every here's game contestant number us. two, we always play. Hogwarts. I don't know what her name is. Rachel Ray and someone else. <laughs> I continue to say that player two must be known as Sweet Tits. I don't know why. But you know what? Alex Trebek could be known as Sweet Tits. I don't care who, I just want to call somebody Sweet Tits during this playthrough. It doesn't need to be gender-based. You know, it could easily be Alex Trebek. It could be Johnny Gilbert, the announcer. Science! science. I'll take science for 800, sweet. Recently days. discovered presidential ads. What the shit? For a second, I thought that said uh, recently discovered presidential aids. Classic rock, I'm out. <laughs> I uh, Classic rock, I've got a good chance at. I've got a pretty good chance at classic rock, so... Uh, yeah, we're doing this, so uh, this is not a joke. Ah, <laughs> uh, God, classic rock opening lines. Let's try it. Alex, what you got? Oh, uh, shit, Proud Mary. Yep. Proud Mary keeps on burning. She should probably get some, uh, you know, Preparation H or some shit. Uh, it's a, Proud Mary. It's a fire that Preparation H won't put <laughs> Yes. And we call that fire John Fogarty's voice, except it's kind of inflamed. Uh, let's let's just own this category. Oh, uh, another brick in the wall. Yeah. Okay, yep. that one's easy. Yep. So okay, far, I'm doing good. Let's wait till the next one when I get utterly crushed. Oh, okay. There we go. So as you can see, you start typing in, and it gives you various options. Sometimes you can cheat a little bit because of that. Um, Raise the roof. Woohoo! Yeah, bring it. I'm white. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, boots key are, uh, these boots are made for walking. Yeah. yeah. Is that really classic rock? Uh, right. no. No, it's really not. Um, it's an oldie, but it's not classic rock. In no stretch of the imagination is this classic rock. The first two, yes. And I say that not liking CCR, but this, no. Classic pop, maybe. Uh, Jojo was a man who thought it. Oh, Jojo was a man who thought he was a loner. I'm gonna. We oh, got. Shit! Why can't I place this? <sighs> shit! I'm just. I'm about to lose all the money I did, but it's. I'm God, losing. I figured it. I'd figure it out. I um, uh... Shit! God, I know that line, and I can't place the song, and this is really sad because I love the Beatles. Fuck. Uh, let's see. I, I'm just like I'm panicking now, and my brain is not gonna. <laughs> Will I get it in in time? Fuck this. I suck. What is fuck this shit, Alex? <laughs> God damn it. Oh, that makes well, me one happy. one of these other two is going to know it. Sweet Tits has got this on lockdown. <laughs> See, Sweet Tits is the pink player. Get back. Really? Okay. Hey, Sweet Tits, get back. I actually wouldn't have placed that because I didn't know that was the name of the song. India. I don't know shit about India. 
Uh, I don't know. Uh, what, uh, Vishnu? Uh, I don't know. Shiva? <laughs> uh, Vishnu's a dude. Oh, well, okay. Fine. But Shiva... I'm not up on that shit. Nope, it is not Shiva. Oh, shit. <laughs> Shiv. Okay, oh, yes, here is the so greatest funny. single fuck-up of this game. Square should be backing out. It is not. It is confirm. For some fucked up reason. I was I actually going to go how with Indira Gandhi. I entered a, yeah, yeah. Circle is back. It, well, no, or is it. I don't know. But it's like fucked Anyways, up. It's the wrong way. Anyways, whatever you think is going to be yeah. the, what would cancel it out is not the one that's actually entered the answer. Gemset Ginata. Uh, I have no fucking idea. What's her name? Do we have a name for her? Yeah. Bombay. Rachel Ray. Rachel Ray. <laughs> Sweet tits and Rachel Ray. Yeah, yeah that works. <laughs> whatever. Oh, uh, We're Suspicious Minds. Suspicious one. Minds, yep. I think. Yes, that's right. Yes. We can't go on together with Sweet Tits and Rachel Ray. <laughs> that's my apparently Billy Ray Cyrus <laughs> that, version of... I was like, that wasn't Elvis. I don't know what I don't know what that there. was. Let's, let's go to recently <laughs> discovered presidential aides. Uh, he said, nation, half slave, and half free can exist. I say he's wrong. I'm Stephen Douglas, and I approve this. Me what is this asking for? Abraham Lincoln? I guess. I don't know. It's gotta be. I hate when Jeopardy gets, like, tries to be clever. And, like, has these categories. And you don't know what they're asking Yeah, for. that yeah. just pisses me off. So what if he's the first West Point grad? Oh, uh, Eisenhower. You yeah. I'm oh, wait, no, wait, wait, maybe, no. No, wait, first West Point grad, that might actually be Ulysses S. Grant. Um, especially with the drinking thing. It has to be Ulysses S. Grant. Yeah. Ulysses S. Grant, the drunkest general in history. <laughs> I remember Lincoln, somebody told him, it's like, you realize Grant's drunk, and he said, well, then tell me what he's drinking so I can send it to the rest of my generals. <laughs> Woohoo! Daily Double. So there's a trophy we're trying to get, which is finding the Daily Double first. Uh, clearly we haven't got it. We didn't get on this play, but... Hey, you know what? I'm on stream. Balls exposed. Let's do this thing. This general had a pirate, John Lafitte, to help him in New Orleans. What's next? I'm John Q. Adams, and I approve his message. Shit. Oh, um... I think John Lafitte. Um, Andrew. Yes. Andrew, Andrew Jackson. Jackson. Should be. Because he was the one down in New Orleans. All right. Yeah, should be Andrew Jackson. That's my guess. Let's do it. Yeah. True daily double, throw, throw, bitches. Throw up the horns. On stream. That's. Why does that matter to me? Uh, we're fucked and we're fucked. So let's get fucked. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Massachusetts. Uh, yeah. And thankfully, I don't have I to spell it. I never noticed Massachusetts had a little dick. <laughs> Did you see that? I never noticed it has like a little thing that comes out on that thing, part that you think is flat. Well, think about it. The Patriots from Massachusetts, oh, yeah. right? So clearly all of Massachusetts has a little dick. That's where the football stadium <laughs> yeah. is. Yeah. It's in Little Dick, Massachusetts. <laughs> Home of Tom Brady. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I know the play. I don't know who wrote it. Uh, some German fucker. Christopher Marlowe. You know what? He's a German fucker. Um... I don't know. I don't know this. I'm curious to know it, because I have a thing for languages. Yeah. Because I like to pick up various phrases from languages, so... Unless it's like... Nam oh, namaste, yeah. So it means to bow? So why the fuck are all these hippies walking around saying it and putting it on the side of their water bottles? it's a yoga thing, I think. Well, okay, but it means to bow. Why would you put that? Like, bow to my water bottle? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Bow to my expensive organic shit that I think yes, is food? Yes, that is exactly what they're saying. Oh, okay. Woo! I got a daily double. Well, how well do you know all of his other songs? Not well enough to put my balls out on stream, so uh, let's let's bet... Uh, a dollar. <laughs> let's bet a thousand. Uh, yeah, let's bet a thousand. In bridge over troubled waters, Simon. Uh, some told her, sail on, sail on by your time has come to shine. Ah, uh, sail, I don't, I, wait, who is? Um, we're looking for a person. I have no idea. Uh, like a bridge over troubled water, this is all you know of this song. Okay. Ah, uh, fuck. Shit. 
other words. Um, I only know the song from the SNL skit where Jan Hooks was like a lounge singer and she like slayed this one. And it was amazing. Well, this is my best guess. <laughs> I think the answer is Jenna Jameson. <laughs> well? Who is Jenna Jameson? No. Oh. What? Wow, wow. Well, well. The correct answer is silver. Oh, go to hell. Please. Stop singing about your hair. As far as we know, Jenna Jameson is also known as Silver Girl. She could be. I'm going to go edit the Wikipedia right now. Well, I'm still at it. Let's see what title possessions is all about. Henry Adams. Um, of Henry Adams? What? I should know this. The something of Henry Adams. Player two. Okay. This is a weird category. This is one I wasn't Player sure what two. they were asking for. I think okay. I get what they're going for, okay. but of Edwin Drood. Um. Let's hear it, Player One. <laughs> I was already there. <laughs> <laughs> the ball sack of Edrin Drood. <laughs> I wasted four hundred dollars on that answer. <laughs> it was worth it. <laughs> oh, that's the great thing about this because you can just say whatever the shit you want. <laughs> it's not real. Statin drugs like Lipitor. Statin drugs like Lipitor used to lower uh, cholesterol. Yeah, cholesterol. There's it's one thing we know one. in America. It's, it's cholesterol. Fucking, no, it's fucking drugs. Oh, that too. <laughs> We're technically you got both for right. Everything. You got 12 drugs for everything. <laughs> well, and the best part is now we have drugs to ease the side Side symptoms of, of the drug of the you're on. Because yeah. we keep seeing the one about like the constipation that only comes from the, like the drug you're on that well, causes the constipation because it's a different kind of constipation. Yeah, it's here, sweet tits. Inshallah. <laughs> Hey, we're still winning somehow, and somehow. we don't know shit, apparently. Yeah, somehow we blindly stumbled through this, including throwing away answers about dicks and ball sacks <laughs> on several questions and losing money. <laughs> Military men. Uh, Military oh, men. The Bible is probably my worst category. Military history is probably my second worst. I don't know shit. I'm betting 5000 on this, roughly half. Um, there's a chance. Uh, Warrior and Wordsmith and the Far Eastern General. Books about this American are subtitled Warrior and Wordsmith and Far Eastern General. Uh, MacArthur. It's my best guess. Douglas okay. MacArthur. Well, that time went by fast. Nah, that's because we all picked it. Okay. Nope. MacArthur's the only Far Eastern one of those because he was leading the battle and uh, General MacArthur led the battle against uh, Japan in World War II. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. You can dance all you want, sweet tits, but you know what? I'm dancing to more money. But you keep dancing and I'll make it rain and let's just dance around Rachel Ray and show her how superior we are to her. Yeah! I'm going to go backstage and have a threesome with these two ladies. It's, uh, you know, well, basically, uh, no matter who wins, we have a threesome. So We're the only three people on Jeopardy you ever. You can celebrate by hitting, I think, oh. the bumpers. Oh, yeah, I forgot you. I always get... Yeah, oh, no, no, smack you, both those asses. No, no, you, that was the sad one. Oh. The other one is the... There you go. Holla! Woo! Holla Woo! if you hear me. Can yeah. I get a whoop, whoop? Bump your butt, bump your butt. <laughs> Booty bumping. <laughs> and, uh, wow, she's excited. Woo, 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 woo. She's Arsenio Halling there at the Jeopardy theme. Arsenio? Yes, Arsenio. <laughs> Be quiet and look at William Harrison. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, guys. I don't need a coat. <coughs> Celebrating our arsenial anniversary. <laughs> That's when you've been married so long, you start slipping the other person arsenic in their tea and hope one of you dies. <laughs> <laughs>